That's what people call me. I'll call you King. Hmm? I'll call you King. Nice to meet you, King. No, you gotta say the whole thing. It don't sound right. Okay, Kingpin. You believe in God? Of course. Are you Christian? Yeah. That's good. That's good. That's good, man. Not many Christians on here. At all. You believe that homosexuality is a sin? Of course. Right. Right. All right, I'll just I'll just remind you of something. And it'll benefit you and it'll benefit me cuz I'm going to hear it too. The gospel. Jesus Christ came into the world, lived the perfect life, died for the sins of all who would believe. That when you trust in him and repent of your sins, you're forgiven of all your sins. When you die, you're with him in heaven forever. You believe that, right? Right. Right. God bless you, man. Thank you for your time. God also flooded a city full of gay people. Yeah, he did. Well, flooded, no. Uh, fire and brimstone. Oh, well, in the Bible, I read it would say flooded. That's Noah, that's Noah and the ark flooded the whole world. No, it was a part in it where it said he flooded a city full of gays. They didn't say it exactly like that, but in that Bible, it said it like that. Okay. Does it's not an it's not an unusual thing that God would do? I mean, kill sinners all the time. God, he wouldn't flood a city of people that he saw as the perfect being. Yeah, yeah that those those people weren't perfect. Right. Right. God so, made Adam and Eve out of Adam and Steve. Right. I believe that. Homosexuality is a sin. I agree you, with you. Are you homosexual? No. Homosexuality is a sin. There you go. It's 1 Corinthians chapter 6, verse 9, and 1 Timothy chapter 1, verse 10. It's clear. Homosexuality is a sin. A man having sex with another man is an abomination. I mean, I'm glad we can agree. 33... Sammy Olson. I'm glad I met a Christian that agrees that homosexuality is a sin. Astrius. Hey, Astrius from Athens. Okay, he's gone. That was refreshing, you know? I don't know what Bible he read that said God flooded a city full of gays, but it's not something that God wouldn't do in the days when he used to rain fire and brimstone on people. I am disputing that it's in the Bible though that he flooded the city full of gays because I've read through the whole Bible, never seen that, but as I said to him, it's not something unusual for God. Hello? Anybody there? I guess not. Tony. This nigga think he boosie. Tell me, I'll show your pussy lips on live. I give you a thousand dollars. He's not boosie. Stop it. You're not boosie, bro. Stop doing that shit. What's up, bro? Why are you just looking at me like that? Follow myself in the middle of a conversation. That's what happened. The first thing you said. Oh, my fault, bro. It was the last nigga. He was saying some weird shit. Fucking weird. I mean, I didn't want to interrupt. Sounded like you were, you know, finishing a point. So I was just yeah, like, Yeah, he he began his point across. Yeah, yeah. God to get the point across. Yeah, you two believe in God? Yeah, all day, all day, all day. You two Christians? Yeah. If it wasn't for God, I wouldn't be here. Oh, God bless you, man. 
So you too. You too believe that homosexuality is a sin? Si. Oh, I, mm, I, got my, I got my opinions on it. Because it's like... I like to hear it. Yeah, it's like in the Bible that you're not supposed to mess with your same gender. But then it's like God put you on planet Earth and he had already created your whole life. So he knew how this was going to go. So it's like... What, what about you? Is it really a sin? Oh, wait, what? But that's the thing, like, is it really a sin if he puts you on planet Earth already planning out your life, knowing how it's going to go? I don't know. I mean, that argument you just made would be condoning for every sin. Couldn't we say the same thing about alcoholism, that God put us here and ordained our whole life, so it's not wrong to get drunk and... Do whatever we it's, want. It's in it's in the Bible, so it tells you like not to do it. So then, yeah. but then everybody got you know they free they free will because God gave that to them. So yeah, so we we can to choose do to life. do the wrong thing. That's true. Yeah, because like then it's like it's like a lot of people that like like a woman married to a woman, but they still believe in God. Like be heavy with God. So sometimes you know they just compromise. Demons believe in God too, but they won't end up in heaven in the end. So just believing isn't enough. It's repentance as well, turning from sin. Because I'm married, but I have attraction for other women. But I resist my temptation because I'm Christian. And it's the right thing to do. See, for me, I just don't look the way. I just, anytime I see another female, I just think about my female. And then, there you go. When you love somebody heavy, you're not going to want to be attracted to nobody else. There you go. Well, what about you? Do you believe you're, 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 what about you? You believe that Chris, that uh, homosexuality is a sin? Did you understand the question? I do, but I'm gone. Like, I, I heard the conversation, but I don't have no way. Y'all can talk. I'm listening to y'all. She don't really got. She really got no purpose, and like she don't really know how she feels about that situation. Yeah. Are you are you a Christian child of God? Yeah. So you believe the Bible? Yeah. Yeah. the The Bible says that homosexuality is a sin. So she's probably the one who she's probably the one who skipped me. She probably, but I'm glad that. Me and the young man was able to have a conversation about it, and she listened. <laughs> no clue. Hello. Hello. What are you doing? What are you doing? Talking to people about God. What are you doing? That is amazing. Thank you. What are you doing? Can you tell me something? Uh, do my nails, my toes. Oh, my that's nails. pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so do you believe in God? Yeah. Are you a Christian? Yeah. Do you believe that homosexuality is a sin? No. Why not? Wait, are you saying, like, do I believe that if you're, like, for example, if you're gay, that's a sin? No, if you live a life of homosexuality, if you're gay and you act it out, is that wrong? Like, if you're gay and say you started dating another guy like that? Yeah. I don't think that's a sin, personally. You believe the Bible? I do, it just, sometimes, I mean, you love who you love. God says love who you love. You know what I mean? Nobody can choose who you really love. I mean, that's, that sounds good, but when you really look into it more, I'm married, I have a wife. What if I love someone else? Is it okay for me to cheat on my wife? No. Right. 
So there's love that's not permitted. There are there's love that's not permitted. There's, there's love that God has boundaries on. We're not allowed to love how we want if loving is sex. Yeah, just skip. Just, just go ahead. You, you, you see, you got to explain these things slowly so that they can understand. And this is a very good topic. Hey, Mano. Do you speak? Yes. It's good. That's good. Are you a Christian? Aren't you concerned that if you die tonight, you might go to hell? What? Aren't you concerned that if you die tonight, you could go to hell? No. Why not? I am Muslim. You're Muslim? Do you believe that Muhammad is a prophet? Do you believe what the Quran says about the Bible in Surah chapter 6, verse 114 and 115? Okay. Put on right here. Wait. Can you see it? Yes. It's too bright. I got it. Put on. Put on. Yes. Yeah, the Quran says that the Torah and the Injil were revealed by Allah. And that yes. Allah's word cannot be corrupted or changed. Yes. Do you believe the Bible? Yes. The Bible says that Jesus Christ died for the sins of those who would believe, rose from the grave. If you repent and trust in him, you're forgiven. Do you believe that? Yes. That's good, man. That's good. Salam alaikum. Salam. God bless you, man. Have a good night. That was good. That was good. Daniel, what's up? Yo, who's that? <laughs> oh, boy, it's getting late, man. It's like 2.45. What's wrong with your nose? Okay, no, no, Nelson. Nelson. Okay. Ishant. So there are people in America who claim to be Christian, claim to believe the Bible. Jamaica. Hey, how y'all doing? Are you guys? Sir, how you doing? Wagwan, Wagwan. I'm doing good. You guys Christians? I'm not really religious, sir. Not really? No, not 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 really. Aren't you afraid that if you die you may wake up in hell? Huh? Aren't you afraid that if you die tonight you wake up in hell? Okay, he's gone. Yeah, so there are people who claim to be Christians and they don't believe the Bible. I'm a, I'm a Christian, myself. Yeah, I've been meeting a lot of people on here claiming to be Christians and they don't believe the Bible. That's just a what contradiction. What do you mean they don't believe the Bible? What do you mean? You ask them, is homosexuality a sin? And they say no. That is a sin. Of course it's a sin. Yeah, man, bro. You are in a world where people don't this believe that. Is, this world is probably coming to an end soon, but... No, the problem, the problem I find is that you claim to be a Christian and you yeah. don't believe the Bible. That's just, that's just a contradiction. That's just... It's because, bro, it's social terrible. media has gotten to these kids, bro, to be honest. That's, dis that's a disappointment. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Oh, boy. But it's good that you're a Christian, man. You die, you'll be with the Lord in heaven. Yeah. Just live a life to shine your light so that God can be glorified in heaven, bro. Yeah, man.
God bless you, man. You too, bro. What happened?